we got some things to still do here in the chasm. I'm also in a Discord call with Zach and uh, gonna be with other people. It's supposed to be up for a raid tonight. So before that, I'm gonna make progress on this and stuff like that. So uh, let's go ahead and do this. I got myself muted in that Discord call, of course, but I wanna finish as much of this as possible. As expected, you came. Please take a seat. Let me see what's left. Black tea is out. Sugar, out too. Alright, here's some milk. Oh, it's turned sour. Gotta throw it away later. Um, my apologies. But there is plenty of fire water, plus some hard tack and sour jam to go with it. Enough for a tea party. Whoa! Do you really consider fire water to be a standard tea party thing? Yep, yeah, what's the problem with it? Uh, I'll pass. What? <laughs> no one's gonna call you out on drinking here. Just suit yourself. What are you up to? Sharing food and intel at the right moment is conductive to silencing a curious mouth. That's what our handbook says. Well, where's the intel? Uh, I just shared it. Huh? Did you tell us anything? Fatui Advi Advance Team Handbook, Appendix 4 through 4, Article 3, Sharing Food and Intel at the Right Moment is con con Conductive, or con con whatever, Concisive, to Silencing a Curious Mouth. You're welcome. You saved my life, and in return, I divulged classified content from our handbook. How's that for sincerity? What's the use of that? <laughs> Jokes aside, Actually, I'm very grateful for your help, but my kind gesture doesn't mean anything else. Uh, what with... With what you people have done, Pyron finds it hard to believe in your kind gesture. What are you up to, really? It's no surprise that Outlanders fail to understand the cause of the Fatui, but when we aren't talking about what purpose or which side we are on, we are just a bunch of ordinary people. Besides, all our agendas and deeds are just, uh, preparatory work for the final battle. The final battle? Yes, in the end, all of us shall face a common enemy in the inescapable long night. Everyone says Naya has been thus be warned. Maybe you're right. I don't know, nor do I care to know. You wanted an explanation, then I gave you one. You're free to not find it to your liking. That's all. Uh, where did all these- where did all that deep stuff suddenly come from? By the way, I've introduced myself, but I do not know your name yet. Lumine. And Paimon is Paimon. Oh, your names. <laughs> We're pretty well known all over the- to that, aren't we? Sorry, I've never heard of you. Either of you, actually. What? Please don't take it the wrong way. I was sent down here a long time ago. I barely know anything about what's happening on the surface, save for the news we get through our supply lines. Eh, uh, doesn't that mean... That your supply line's been cut off? Tea party's over. I need to get some rest. Excuse me. Hey, we haven't even started eating yet. Leave already. Didn't you just frown upon my fire water? That's because Paimon didn't think it was drinkable. People have different food preferences, you know. Hmm. By the way, uh, Lumin, please wait. I it's nothing. I'm just thinking that if it were you, uh, please come back another day if you don't find it too troublesome. Well, I guess free Primo gems for me. I guess I've come back another day. I need to get some rest now. My old injuries still hurt. My apologies. Please come back another day if you have more questions. I'll also have a favor to ask. So could I move the time forward and get more free Primo gems, or should I finish up the quest? I'm gonna speed time along a whole thing like this and see what happens. Oh, 
I've been playing some Remnant from the Ashes today before getting on this, and I found that it has one of the worst scoping mechanics in the game, because they want you to double tap the aim button and hold to actually aim in with a sniper. What the hell is that? And yes, I need to wait a real world day for this. And then I also played some more Monster Hunter today, just to, like, get some equipment just at the start of the game. And... I guess the game is still getting constant updates, even today, because there was an event going on. And I'm wondering if I should have me and Zack start it up, if there really are still more events happening in the game. I got a full event armor set, so... But I am also missing only one more Lumen Spear, Spur, whatever the fuck it is. But I can only get that through doing the main story quest. Which is not happening anytime soon. Wait, why am I running there? It was this one. So, I'm just going to purify this, get this quest done with, and that'll practically be it. The last one is all the way up there. Maybe I should go through the middle. I'm going to go through the middle. Once I get this done, I will be happy because it means that I am practically... Well, not just this. Once I do another thing after this, another side quest that has to do with the chasm, then I'm practically done with the chasm until the main story quest. Which, again, I'm not doing until Sumeru comes out. Also, I have a feeling my PlayStation is probably cutting the recording, as it usually does. And if it is, I'm going to be annoyed. I can't figure out ways to fix it anymore. But anyway. This is about, I think, the last day I'll have to mess around in Genshin. For a bit, until I find out when Sumeru comes out, and whatever events come around as well. that on, because why not hit this, do this, and just stand behind it so nothing hits me. Ow, 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 okay, that one blew it. Also, beforehand, I thought they meant when you do this, I thought they wanted me to hit this, hit the thing with the, with the power and stuff. I thought the way I was just doing it. It actually can't go anymore, because I don't have enough. Also, about to lose one here. There we go, we did it! Hmm, looks like you come to the bit where we gotta apply some external force to the crystal. You ready, Lumine? Are you sure the diagrams on the stone tablet are reliable? Will we come this far? Let's just give it a shot like we always do, eh? Ah, <sighs> Paimon, what will I ever do with you? Alright, come on, it's a big crystal. Don't you just want to poke it? No. Because I'll probably die. See, this, it, it, I want to talk about how this looks tech. This looks a little techy. Like, look at, it looks like some data streams or something. Like, what is this? What do we have getting in the, oh, cutscene. Another reused cutscene. <laughs> Oh my god, they've just mixed together a bunch of unreused cuts. They just mixed together the cutscene where we attack Osile's wife and the cutscene where Wumin grabs Toma's vision. But I knew I was gonna have to fight this guy at some point. I'm gonna need this. I knew this guy was gonna end up showing up in the end. I just knew it. That's why I didn't try fighting him earlier. Um, I've got to have something. Barbados, guide us. By royal decree. Oh, don't tell me I need the thing for this, though. Oh, I need this? But because I took it off, I don't have any power. 
Boro Boros? I'm not playing Resident Evil 5. So wait, if I break this, I get power? I can't even really break it. Ow, ow, ow. Yeah, this is fair. I literally cannot do anything about it. Oh, I can't even really damage it because of that. Shadow Raven, let night fall. This is just gonna be a long fight because I don't have the shit. All right, I'm just gonna just gonna take a minute and just hit this up. Can I do this for hours? Windblade. I can. Yeah, now I can get rid of this shit. Show it off. They're not going to bring back another crystal for me. Wind, hear me. Oh, wait, there it is. Just stay here for the healing. Oh, of course it, it comes out right where I'm standing to heal. Windblade! I'm gonna let it try and power. Okay, now I stop. Oh, it's actually best to save this for this one. No, no, it is not. I thought he was gonna stay stunned, but he did. Giant digging device of the lost realm. Lost realm. They couldn't exactly come up with something a little better. Ow. I'm gonna lose the food buff before this ends. I've wasted so much. I just got rid of these. Oh, it's 
Sounding like I'm not doing that raid tonight anyway, because we were missing some people. By royal decree. This is gonna be a waste, I'm calling it. Alright, I know what he's doing now. Oh, don't try and tell me he's running or he's gonna run away. Excuse me? You really gonna pull that shit? Man, they are really giving, they are actually giving cutscenes a oh, shit ton of effort. Uh, wait, what? Side quest. They're giving side quest cutscenes and a shit ton of effort. And hopefully, now that she's saved us, uh, she could now, uh, w when I have to summon for her, she actually uh, joins the team. Something tells me she won't. And I kind of wish that I saw that thing break apart and not disintegrate when it was killed. I I is it over? It all kind of feels like a dream. Of course, it also had to leave when I used another food buff, wasting it. Looks like that thing up there has gone back to normal. The air feels less heavy, too. Even though we reached the bottom of the chasm and even defeated the creature down there somehow, but it doesn't feel like we've answered any questions. In fact, we've got more questions now than we did before. Like, for example, what was that thing above us? Why did a giant serpent come roaring out? Where did that dark mud and strange monsters come from? The monsters that followed the dark mud here seem to be eating at the big crystal. And she mentioned that Yaxo was once here. This has too many questions for Paimon. Looks like the chasm still has many secrets that are yet to be discovered. Yeah, no wonder adventurers like her are so committed to exploring this place. But things should be should quiet down a bit in here, now that we've cleared this big thing up, right? Still, looks like a long way before the mines can reopen. Are we really gonna, like, say that we didn't? notice her? Did they not notice her? Mm. But our exploration mission seems complete. We'll worry about that other stuff in the future. Oh yeah, one more thing. It feels like someone helped us out during the fight with the big big snake. Did you hear this shroom during the fight? Sort of. Well, never mind. When we head back, we can ask sh we can ask her if she saw any strangers. No oh, did my headphones die? My headphone went off. That's why I hear nothing coming from the Discord call anymore. I gotta return to the camp now. Kind of bullshit that I fought that guy and can't get any rewards from him. But I now see something that I didn't notice before, and that's that girl. Her name is Yilin. Yilin? Whatever, however you say her name. It seems I've now noticed that she has purple lipstick on. Anyway, how are you feeling? Don't tell me you're still dying. Great, you're back! Yep, we're back! There's been several earthquakes ever since you went through that gate. We don't know what's going on down there, but we're glad to see that you're both okay. Well, you don't look too bad yourself. Looks like the rest helped. How are things on your end? Uh, I followed your advice and rested here all this while. I'm feeling a whole lot better now, with all this, uh, with all this due to that thing behind the gate. Or was all this? 
I didn't go in there, but I could feel some strange pulsing within. Something amazing must have happened back there, I'm sure of it. <clears throat> Hold on. <clears throat> I, I grew up with singing Tales of the Yakshas, and some of the seniors used to say that one of them was sealed inside the chasm and slumbers to this day. Well, we didn't meet this Yaksha you speak of. There was, a there was a huge floating crystal in there. I see. Thank you. So, as far as the dark mud, we... <clears throat> Sorry. It hasn't been completely cleared out. It will experience a gradual retreat, though. Yep, now that we've removed the taint, the, the taint from that large crystal, that stinky mud shouldn't, should not uh, should be back underground in no time. I understand. <clears throat> Uh... <clears throat> it seems that our exploration of the chasm has met with some initial success. Can I send that message I'm trying to send? This, this is way stronger than that time at the whatever village. What's that? Hmm? It's the most famous tea house in Weiwei. Top-notch scenery, top-notch tea, you haven't heard of it? Well, not that I like the place very much. Even if it is my second home after Me Mijun Village, I know every last creek and tree in that place like the back of my hand. I guess I would have remembered this place and the people more fondly if it wasn't for that disagreement I had with the one commission giver while on a map-making assessment. Eh, whatever. No point talking about that now. And, well, I say I don't like the place, but if I do achieve something great this time, it would be good to go back there to rest. The old man's tea is a truly unforgettable experience, after all. But over to more pleasant thoughts. The next time I'm back home, it'll be a famous advent. I'll be a famous adventurer having tea with the old man. You know, I do hope you'll be there to see it. <laughs> there I go again, talking about unrealistic stuff. Well, we could use this opportunity to become an official ex exploratory team under the Ministry of Civil Affairs, but I don't think we'll be going anywhere anytime soon. After all, it was due to your spelunking that we were able to avoid the perils of the p of the path, such that no one was injured or lost, and our material losses proved negligible. I think we might stay here for a while yet, help the Ministry staff watch over the underground anomalies, and maintain the exploration facilities. Did you encounter any strangers after we left? Mmm, well, I didn't see anyone on the way back, and I fell asleep pretty quickly once I got back to camp. So I didn't see anyone else pass by. What's wrong? What's with the sudden question? Never mind, it's nothing. Well, if you're leaving, don't forget to say hi to Mooning as well. <clears throat> Tell him that I'm going to be promoted. Who knows who's going to be the boss of... Uh, you, whatever. Do we really have to? Ah! Just end the quest. Wait, I still... Wait, do I get the cup? for ending this quest, or do I have to go find it? I don't know, I have to go find it, because there's another quest that gives you the cup. And that is why I have marked something to do that. What are you staring at? I forgot there was actually one whole other thing I had to do. I knew there was one another quest to do, but I forgot that there was a whole new quest to do. Oh yeah, I can take this damn thing off. If I could load, I could take the thing off. You're back, Lumi. How did things go? There's good news to be had from the underground, I hope. <laughs> See what I told you. The exploration team were a reliable lot, and the expedition was bound to be fruitful. I've received the ore samples and data from Kadai and Jinwu have gathered. The unknown matter is in full retreat, and the geological shifts have largely seized. It's a good omen indeed. Thanks to your help, the mill have also expressed no objections to our plans for further exploration and restoration. 
In fact, they should be greatly ready to descend into the mine themselves. I don't remember you expressing such support before. That's right. So, who was the one who was trying their best to prevent us from going down previously? Hmm? <laughs> uh, come on now. There's no need to be so straight about such things. I mean, I will pay you, and of course the Chasm Exploration Team will become an official part of the Hall from, the day, from this day forth. You need to work on your ability to change the topic. That's right, but since there's more to be had, we'll forgive you this time. <laughs> Thank you. And you know, I did get a real earful from the higher-ups myself for letting you go down there without such a... so much as a report back from headquarters. The higher-ups? Who? Yeah, and who would bother coming down here themselves to give you an earful anyway? You might not believe me, but it was the Yu Hong herself. She seemed quite concerned for your safety. Seriously? So ka has been, been keeping an eye on us this whole time? But the person we met down there didn't look anything like her. You actually saw that person? You forgot? It's the one who went zoom and went right past us. It was super flashy and stuff. You met someone else down there. Are you certain that it wasn't a treasure hoarder or a fatuous? This is certainly worth recording, but don't worry, the mill will help you look into it. Ah, uh, yes, we'll mean. Since I'm currently in charge of the exploration team's material needs, could I also ask you how things are with them at the moment? It, she's not looking too good. That's right. She's still down in the mines, and she's not in the best of conditions. Mm, Jin Wu did mention her condition to me. I'll send a report com recommending that the Ministry send a medical team down. With any luck, she'll be patient to stay out of any hazardous zones. Opo joined up, but... He was a treasure hoarder previously. Will things really be okay? Oh, him? We all know him. He's not a bad person by nature. If you ever trust him, Umin, I don't think we'd gain gainsay you. Still, I think he'll be he'll have to wait for a while before he can be welcomed in any official capacity. Let's just call it in in a probation period, shall we? About to dive. Or that fellow from Sumeru. I won't lie to you, you can think of him as a sort of proxy. On the surface he seems to be organizer and overall in charge, but in truth even he answers to the Ministry of Civil Affairs. Of course, this comes with some academic uh, agreement that the Chi Sing have with the Academy. The people upstairs went back and forth of the Academy for a while now, and I'm not at liberty to say more in any case. Whatever the case, a leader from overseas is not exactly someone we would normally use. But since he's willing to pay for the team from his own pocket, I suppose we have little reason to refuse his help. Well, what's the agreement going to be from now on? Our arrangement. The mystery will send more people down there. I suppose we've got to trouble our dedicated professional to dwell into the perilous depths for us again. Again? <clears throat> anyway, thanks for your help. You're always welcome at the chasm. Yes, indeed. And there you go again, changing the topic so suddenly. Okay, okay, let's not get too hot and bothered about that. In any case, the Ministry thanks you for your services, and we will not stand in, in the way of your activities within the chasm any further. Yeah, that should have been the main quest, honestly. But also, did I really mark the wrong location for this quest? Because why did... there's a thing up there, so why did I mark this? Because this is the quest. What happened? He was absent this morning during the head count. Where on earth is he? If the higher-ups find out, I'd be toast. Oh, you're here. Good timing. What happened? Why are you sighing? <sighs> to tell you the truth, a miner from our camp went missing. The chasm is a complex environment. Though things have stabilized a bit lately, it's still dangerous deep inside. So we made a rule to take a head count every morning and evening. But we haven't seen him since last night. Do you mean the miner who keeps praising his daughter? Yeah, that's him. During the headcount last night, other miners said that he had just met him, and that he might return very really soon, so I'd had to go. But this morning, he was still nowhere to be found. Other miners were ev evasive, so I pressed them for an honest answer. It turned out that Chi Ding had returned the whole hadn't returned the whole night. Now we're in big trouble. Don't tell me it's happening again. Has something similar happened before? Oh, this is something that only Ministry of Personnel should know. But since you're the hero who saved Li Wei, I think I can make an exception for you. This was before the chasm was sealed. At first, it was a strange rumor among the miners that something in the chasm could make their wish come true. We had warned them to report the Huishin Hall, should they encounter anything unusual. Yet some miners tried their luck. 
they went looking for the chasm's bounty. In secret, and ended up going missing one by one. But we found that we found them sometime later.